Alrighty, what's poppin'? In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys the best settings for Pokemon Legends Arceus. That includes playing the game at 60 FPS, playing the game in 4K, and improving the life quality of the game, making the game looks more clear, uh, improving certain aspects of the game, like trees and stuff like that. I'm gonna showcase you guys how to do that in today's video. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So when you go to the option tab, go to settings, go to system, and then when you're in the system, if you're trying to play the game past 60 FPS, you want to uh, basically disable um, V-Sync, leave that off. Now also when you go to resolution scale, I only recommend this if you have a strong PC that's able to play games in 4K. You can always go up to 4X and the resolution scale, this automatically put the game in 4K. I only recommend this if you have a good enough PC that's able to play 4K games. If you guys don't have a PC that's not good with 4K, I do not recommend doing this at all. So please keep that in mind. And after that, you basically apply that and then you go to save. There's not much you can do with the settings in Ryu Jinx. It's not too advanced compared to RPCSP, but you can mess around with certain things to improve your settings and um, gameplay gameplay experience when you when you're using the emulator. Also, I'm basically gonna leave in the description down below to the 60 FPS mod. I'm showcase you guys how to set it up real quick. All you have to do is basically drag and drop it to wherever you please. You can drop it, drag and drop it to your desktop. Put it down here. What you do here, you just use left click, go to mod the directory. As you can see, just basically drag and drop it. I already did this already, so I'm not gonna do this again. So I'm not gonna do it double times. Exactly that. Next, you wanna mess around with basically your um, NVIDIA control panel. This is for NVIDIA users only. So please keep that in mind. All right, when you go to adjust, image with preview use my preference emphasizing you're obviously going to go towards more performance because you're trying to push the emulator to basically the most power you can get out of your pc so i recommend doing that set configuration always use your graphics card manage 3d settings now, I'm not gonna go over too much of every settings. If you guys wanna have the same exact setting, I recommend you guys pausing the video and basically try to get the same settings as me. We'll go all the way down. So I'm gonna emphasize three important, uh, basically um, settings on this. Vertical sync, obviously if you're trying to play games past um, 30 FPS, just turn it off. Triple buffering, that can be turned off as you please. And shader cache, obviously this is very important when it comes to emulation. You can leave it in driver default, but you can mess around with it a little bit. But my recommendation is using a uh, driver default due to the fact that it's basically going to use the default settings. Most of the times it's pretty good, depending on your PC, but it works pretty well with me. And then you're gonna go on to the Program settings. It's basically the same thing. High performance NVIDIA processor. Make your way down here. Basically the same thing as before. You basically copy what settings I actually have while you pause the video. So, yeah. And after you do that, you can go to add. Uh, I'm gonna look for the right jinx. So the Ryu Jinx should pop up somewhere. If you don't see anything like that, you go to always, you always can browse. So look on Ryu Jinx. That's how you find it when you don't see it on add automatically. To add the Ryu Jinx emulator, basically apply it. Apply it. Gotta wait a little bit. 
And then we basically all set to go. Next thing, if you guys want to mess around with um, mods or anything like that, approve the experience, I'll basically leave the description down below to the game banana. As you can see, they have stuff like improved AI, uh, no reflections, and there's things that improve the gameplay experience, increasing um, distortion portal, um, timer, make it longer, increase shiny rates, but I think all in the beginning. You got an invincible player mod, basically stuff that enhance your gameplay experience. What else? I see a couple things. This is, uh, I think it's improving the character models, and this is a high NPC resolution. Where was the, there you go, quality of life enhancement. This is so far the most popular one. And how you basically do this is pretty simple. You just manually download it. Download it. I'm gonna drag it right here. Close that out real quick. Open it up. I'm gonna delete this zip file. And I set up this basically the same way how you would set up um, mods in general. Open mod that mod directory. Put it right there. Exit out, and you're basically all set to go. So those are basically the best settings you can possibly use for Pokemon Legends Arceus on the Ryu Jinx emulator. Uh, I would show gameplay, but you know, Nintendo's gonna claim this video if I show any type of emulation gameplay or anything that's related to that <laughs> at all. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a like, share, also subscribe guys and new to the channel. And yeah guys, this is your boy Brooks and I'll see you guys in the next video. Signing off. Peace.